Hello everyone, today I have Final Destination 5 on Blu-ray, DVD, and Ultraviolet Combo Pack. Um, I do like the cover, it is not, you know, it's kind of popping out, but it's not lenticular or anything. Um, I did see, but after I bought this, I bought this at Movie Stop. Movie Stop actually did have uh, just a couple of the 3D versions there, and I wish I would have seen them before because I would have asked if I could have bought that uh, instead of this one. Because the, um, the, it says 3D in like a big blood splatter, and it is lenticular. But, uh, I do have this one, uh, now streaming instantly for, uh, I'll try that digital copy. That's the side of it. There's the other side of it. And here's the back of it. With some of the special features. Actually, I think that's all the special features. And then a little bit about, about what the movie is about right there. But if you're getting number five, I believe you've seen one through four. I actually haven't seen four yet, but I did see this one in theaters and thought it was pretty good. Um, I haven't heard some really good things about four, but I got it in, um, like when it first came out, it's got the glasses in it. And I got it for like $20. Um... If you don't have 1 through 3 on Blu-ray yet, Best Buy does have 1 through 3 for $10 a piece uh, for Blu-ray. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I have the old DVDs and I think I got rid of them. So I think I'm going to pick up 1, 2, and 3 on Blu-ray. That way I'll have 1 through 5. Open. And, um, if you do not want the combo pack and you just want the movie, there is also a one-disc, uh, Blu-ray out. And I believe that one is $20. This one's 22 in most places right now. So, um, I would, uh, I would just say get this one for the $2 extra, and that way you'll be getting more content from it. And... Because the one disc, I'm almost positive, has no features. That's usually what they like to do, is they usually love to not put any features with them. But this one does. And I'm not sure if the, um, the DVD in here will have special features or not. I'm just going to assume no. But here is your ultraviolet digital copy. And on the back it says get your rewards, you will get 150 points um, WB Insider Rewards. And as I say with every um, Warner Brothers unboxing that I do, if you're not signed up for that, it's absolutely free and I recommend you do it. I've actually gotten the first Harry Potter movie absolutely free using my points in the Ultimate Edition on Blu-ray and I'm working towards the second one. But anyway, here's the discs. Over here is the Blu-ray. Uh, it's a white. I thought it would be gray, but it's a white um, Blu-ray artwork. And over here is the DVD. It looks almost exactly the same, but it's red. But for this type of movie, I actually prefer the red because of the blood. Um, I will throw a, a little bit of a warning out right now. If you are not a fan of blood, or if you're really, really squeamish, this is probably one of the bloodiest in the franchise so far. And, um, I really wish that I had a 3D TV. I would have bought this one in 3D. Uh, I saw it in 3D in theaters, and they did the 3D extremely well. So if you're on the fence about getting the 2D or the 3D and you have the choice, get the 3D version because it's actually going to be really good for you um, if they did it exactly what they did in theaters. And I don't see them changing anything for a video release. Uh, but that's it for today. Um, I will see you guys next Tuesday because I believe I have another release coming out. Um, I'll see you guys then.